Welcome back, everybody, to 70s to Dying Alpha 21 Experimental. I'm an old guy, Gaming, and in this episode, we're going to go attempt our first Tier 3 Infestation quest. Oh, boy. Uh, <laughs> so, let's see. Uh, you can see I do now have my cement maker, uh, uh, cement mixer, rather, uh, crafted here, and it's currently making concrete mix. We have 600 already made, plus another 492 in there. Um, so on day 27 during the day, I'm going to be working on the horde base, um, you know, to get that set up. Uh, to prepare for this tier 3 infestation, we've got two full stacks of 762s. I'm going to start using cobblestone blocks to block doors when I feel it's um, warranted because these zombies are going to be nasty, you guys. We're also carrying uh, sewing kits. Extra bandages, painkillers, plaster casts, vitamins, three honey, you know, all the stuff we might need to deal with criticals if we get them. Maybe I should say when we get them. And uh, yeah, so I think we're ready to set out and give this this thing a try. Oh my goodness, this is going to be crazy. Uh, I started a new mine uh, over here. I'll just show that to you really quick. This is not a resource. Well, it's not a an ore mine. It's a stone mine, at least at present. But it basically just goes all the way down to bedrock there. And then I started uh, working my way uh, towards the west. I haven't haven't run into an ore vein yet, but I'm sure we will eventually. But mostly I did that, you know, to get stone. And then I... Oh. Uh, we must be, like, really close to one of our our quests. Um, And then I also dug up a bunch of clay, too, because we needed the clay for the forge and stuff. And so I'm working on a moat here, as you can see, uh, and getting clay at the same time. So we're kind of killing two birds with one stone in regards to that. Okay, so uh, let's go into here, grab this. We want to do our Tier 3 infestation. And uh, that is really close by. It's just right over here. That's, uh, yeah, that was that little tune that just played for us there. Um... So that house is a tier three, huh? It's not a very big house. I wonder if it has like a big underground area or something. The Philippe residence. Oh yeah, I've done this house before. Hmm. I didn't know this was a tier three. I would have guessed that this was a tier two, but apparently it's a tier three. Okay. So um, let's go into the gay rollers first and just do see if there's any a little bit of preloading we can do and pre-poking. Uh, oh, yeah, as you can see, I now have a level two steel spear, so yay me. Uh, also made a blue pickaxe, and I ha already had a blue shovel. Uh, so we're moving up in the world. Okay, let's just double loot this. Uh, okay. And, oh, shit, you know what? I really should be carrying a shovel around to get concrete, even though I can make it. Um... Yeah, I'm going to leave that there. Is that concrete too? Yeah, you know what? I don't want to pass that up. I'm going to run back to the base really quick, you know, because we haven't started the quest yet. Grab my shovel. I'll be right back. Okay, let's go ahead and harvest this cement. Good. Uh, since we're, we might as well hit the cobblestone thingy too. I need the clay. Check this workbench. And we already looked in there. Okay. Uh, I think that's all the double looting we'll do. Let's actually just run around the outside of the house real quick. Oh, um, mailbox, actually. Oh, I've already looted this mailbox, though. So, okay. Yeah, we're going to be upgrading this thing to parts of it, anyways, to concrete. Uh, we'll do the lower blocks in concrete and... Um, the, the little upper section up there where they have to climb up the ladder, I'm probably going to make that entire thing concrete because they, they tend to hit on that, um, almost more than anything else. Um, and we'll probably do, you know, depending on how much concrete I have, of course, we'll probably do these four and then the stuff that's still wood, I really should at least make cobblestone just in case it gets nailed by, you know, either boss buzzard or cop spit. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and get this sucker started. So this is a clear quest only. Let's go back into the garage again real quick. Let's just 
chill for a second and get us some stamina back. Make sure everybody's loaded too, by the way. It's always a good idea. All right. Um, I'm going to put... Ooh. We got... Oh, I got pipe bombs and molotovs too. I guess we'll put the molotovs down there for the moment. Oh, no. We got our first irradiated, you guys. Ah, shit. Okay. Um... Well, you know what? I can't go back. I can't go back to the base now and get my rad remover. Um, but we're going to need, we're going to want that. So, all right, let's do this. Let's put those down on the toolbar. Let's see if there's any possibility at all we could pull this guy without pulling the other one. Okay, that worked pretty good. All right, here we go. Dude, the hell are you going? Come here. He's like, say, no, you got a cobblestone block. I'm going where things are easier. All right, whatever, dude. Make up your frickin' mind. You gotta kill these guys quick because they regenerate their health without a rad remover. Okay, there we go. Uh, nice. And we have a skill point too. Okay, yeah, I'll we'll take all that stuff. You have unlocked repair tools, nail gun quality. Oh, nice. We can make nail guns now. Fan friggin' tastic, man. That is some really good news. I think we're going to leave that cobblestone block there and just break this. There's another forge ahead. I don't, we don't really actually technically need those anymore. We have all the workstations now. Um, yeah. Well, hmm, let's see something here. If we go to here, well, I mean, I suppose. If we really get super unlucky and we just plain don't find a crucible until level 75, then yeah, it's still still worth reading them uh, from that standpoint, I suppose. Hopefully that doesn't happen, but you know, could, I suppose. Okay. I was going to... Oh, I know what else I was going to tell you guys. I, uh, I had another point to spend, and I put that point into Motherload because, you know, I was doing some mining. So we have a point now in Motherload. This new point... I think we're going to go back to focusing on agility. Uh, so we have one point in everything except for deep cuts. Um, so, yeah, let's put a point in deep cuts. Because uh, we are, at this point in, in time anyways, the plan is to go spec into agility. We will get back to uh, perception too, but uh, right now... We're focusing on agility. All right, so I see two red dots in there. Let's set that there. We'll hit this. That door's locked. We need to keep an eye on that door, though, because the zombies could come around to that side. So we just have to be mindful of that. Anyway, we could get a sneaky sneak off on any one of these dudes. Not not a hedge sneaky sneaky shot. We could get a a foot sneaky sneaky shot. Oh man. You're just a normal Arlene. 
Uh, but you're not a normal Arlene. You're a normal biker, though, thank goodness. He was a near radiated biker. I don't know, man. We'd have a hard time killing him. <laughs> okay. All right, let's uh, bust this up. That's the downside to using cobblestones. Now we got to break them, but I don't want to die. I really don't want to die. We've already seen one irradiated Zeker. Take that and that. Nope. Actually, you know what? I am going to grab that because we're really close to the house. And uh, I've used quite a bit of it to make the um, uh, the hobo stuff. So, okay. Let's see. Four dots and two pairs of legs. Soldier Zeke. What the hell's going on? They're beating on that. Hey, how did you get out of there? That's not allowed. Not allowed at all. Get rid of that stuff. They're trying to break through that other door. What do you guys... Will you guys make up your mind, please? Hmm. Okay, this is where they are. Just a normal Steve. Well, a normal Steve that dropped a yellow bag for us. Uh, we might as well just cut right through here. Nice eyeballs, dude. All right. Oh, look at that. Nice. I mean, we can make a blue one, but still, that's a nice find. I'll take it. We have a steroid, too. Uh, and we're encumbered, so I don't know. I'll have to think about that one. Okay. Dealt with him. Close that door for a second. Uh, I'm going to scrap that. Okay. So this gives us an escape route out of this way. If needed. Nice. In fact, let's take one of those right now. I'm going to chuck all three of those things because, <clears throat> well, actually, you know what? Hold on. Let's get the clay and the stone back. We might as well turn that into cobblestone. Okay. No. We can make sand super easy now with our cement mixer. I'm not going to. Take an inventory slot with it. I believe we're going to have some Zeke's just right around the corner on the right-hand side. So let's just stay here in this spot for a second and do a little bit of looting. Rooting, tooting, looting. Um, do we have scrap iron in here? 
No, so I'm not going to bother picking up that cooking pot. Okay, yeah, we're going to get somebody in here, most likely. We don't need to eat at the moment, so I'm not going to waste food. All right, that's a skater punk guy. That brought five more red dots up, though, on our screen. Oops. Anybody we can get a sneaky sneak off on? Oh, okay. Well, we just have to deal with him. He's not so bad. And you're not so bad. I don't know what else is coming, though. Yeah, we got to at least got a... Oh, we got a feral biker. Two feral bikers. All right, it's time for this. And a soldier. Man, these are some nasty Zeeks, guys. Let's quickly get... Uh, where is my axe? Get that down here so we can repair. Man, I hate that stupid crouch thing that they... Crawling thing that they do. All right. Don't want that bastard to hit me. Okay. Um, all right. Let's uh let's break this out. I'm gonna put um those down there. Don't want that. You know what? I am actually gonna toss this just because it's kind of heavy. All right, that presumably takes care of all the zombie doodles in this immediate vicinity. Uh, nothing there. Let's check this. Nope. Now watch us find, like, a crap ton of rotten meat. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to take those for blueberry pie. We don't need any leather right now, so I'm going to leave all the leather here. Look at that. All right, let's open this sucker up. Crossbow, not a very good one though. Um, not even really probably worth selling, so I think we're just gonna scrap it. All right, so we've cleared the ground floor. Oh my goodness. Rid of that. Let's close that door. Okay. So this door is unlocked. That door is unlocked. That one is locked. Let's go see what's going on in here first. Make sure we're fully loaded here. Bathroom. Oh. Just a normal Steve in there. <laughs> Just. Oh my goodness. I don't know what to say about that. I really don't know what to say about that. Toilet paper. Plastique. Okay. All right, here we go. Two red dots there. We got a free shot on Skater Punk. 
Okay, let's just put a normal block down for a second. I just want to see what we're dealing with. Alright, we can handle this, I think. He's got a bleed on him. Not so bad. Oh, you can't go through those anymore, huh? Alright. Interesting. The heck? Oh, we should be careful. There could be a zombie in there. There is not, but there is a purse. Seven dukes. Handguns. Um, there is a secret thingy up here. We don't have any scrap iron, so we're not going to take that. All right, so what we're going to do is come into this next room. I think I'm going to ditch that. Actually, you know what? Let's just take this. Let's just do it because it's going to going to help. We've got plenty of mineral water to counteract the thirst. So this is different. This used to be a window that you had to come through. But now it's a thing, but there's a lot of zombadoodles in here. And so what we're going to do is... This. We're done. <laughs> Return to the trader. Nice. Okay. Sure, we'll take two wood. All right. We have completed, ladies and gentlemen, our very first Tier 3 infestation quest. We survived it. Yeah, yes. Killed all those mofos with two pipe bombs. The door's locked. Okay, we have to go up to the attic to get the loots, but there shouldn't be any Zeeks up there. Boy, I hope not. Yeah, it said it said we we completed it, so. Okay, let's um get the small stuff first. Very nice. Uh yeah, we don't need to take those. We're gonna probably have to go make two trips. Yeah. Well, let me just show you what we got, and then I'll come back and get this stuff after a cut. Okay, let's look at the normal loot. Uh, okay, that's pretty good stuff. We'll take that, and I'll come back for that stuff, and then let's look at the cash. Uh, this knife is actually probably better than this, but not, not, not by much, though. And, yeah. Okay, so I will come back and grab all this stuff and go. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to come back, grab all this stuff, go to the base, drop it off, and then I'll meet you guys at Jin's for the turn-in. We never checked the mailbox. Okay, I'll grab that later, too. Hi, Jin. Yeah, that's what I think, too. Now that you have some money to spend, we're running a 10% off sale for the rest of the day. I think we're going to take the steel. Okay. Next job. She has another tier 3 infested like clear you handle yourself. at the McMillan Water. residence. Oh, thank goodness. I couldn't find anyone to do that job. All right, let's, um, I've got a few things to sell to her. A couple of these things I had at the base uh, waiting to be sold. So let's sell all of this. 
didn't have any extra mods that I wanted to put on those. All right, so we're up to 12,000 coin. I think we've already looked at her inventory, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we did. Okay. I hope you get feeling better. Okay, well, um... Excuse me. I think we're out of time in this episode. Unless... Oh, Darlene! Cut it out. I mean, we have a couple of tier ones that we could do quickly, but the problem is they're 1.5 clicks away. Um, so I think what I'm going to do, guys, is wrap up the episode here. I'm going to go do this because we've already been to this trader wreck, so you guys have seen where it's at. I'm going to just finish this. I'm going to do these two tier ones. But this Roslyn is actually a new place. Uh, what the heck? I'll cut the camera here. I'll meet you guys at this Roslyn place. Let's do it. Uh, what am I doing? I'm going here. Roslyn active. Okay, I'll just see you guys there. AK-47. Quality 2. And we are here at the Roslyn Residence. I don't recognize this POI, at least not from... Yeah, I think this is new. It does not look familiar. Let's check the car. And we'll poke our head into here. Check in here real quick. Nope, not taking that. We will take potatoes though. Don't think we're gonna take the gas. Um all right, well let's just start it because we are out of time here. Or running out of time anyway. Okay, this is a clear of the area. Check the car again. Uh, we'll take that and that. Don't need that. Oh, now we got a cop. Great. This little... I can't kill this damn crawler. I'm trying to deal with the copper risky here. Little son of a bitch, man. He gave us a freaking abrasion. Man! Alright, well, it is what it is. Let's take this. Let's take a hobo stew for both healing and hydration and food. Let's check this again. Really beat that cabinet up, didn't he? Nobody in there. Got ourselves a toolbox. I guess we go this way. We got ourselves a snake. Oh my goodness. How many snakes are there here? Duffel bag, some magazines. What was that? What was that? I did not recognize that noise. Spears. Duffel bag. Nope. Coffee. Okay, so that's it for the kitchen. There's probably going to be a zombie in here. Oh, 
or not. Take that to, to sell. Is this door? easy enough nobody in there Let's see if we get the shoddy messiah all right we'll take those two things but not the bone uh dusters okay take all of that and the ammo all right, where's the turn in for this? It's, oh, it's only 293 meters away. All right, let's go do that before we wrap up the episode. That was a very easy POI. Even for a tier one, it was easy. Stop staring. Uh, I guess I'm going to have to pay you now that you did it. What does this do? Use no stamina while sneak sprinting. That's useful. Um... We already have armor pocket mods. Molotovs. I think we... <clears throat> I know we have a tempered blade. Maybe even a serrated. Yeah, let's take the Great Heist, I think, in this particular case. And this is the opening trade rat. Squirtsed. Okay, good. All right, let's take a look at your inventory. I don't really want to sell anything. Well... You don't buy something next time, I'll shoot you. I'll shoot you. Um, we have, I think I have a football helmet back to base, but I don't remember what level it is. So I'm going to keep that until I can figure that out. Um, okay. So let's take another job from you. you just got some fetches and some Zombo clears. We are, let me look at the map. We want to take something to the Southwest, preferably West, East, East, West. Um, okay, well, I guess we'll just take. I've got work. If this is new, Barbosa well, residence. Good luck. By the looks of it, you're gonna need it. Want we'll to look at his inventory? Got some sledgehammers, nerdy glasses. Yeah, nothing real. You're getting on my nerves. Fantastic man. there. All right, you guys. So uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do this Presley Dwellers because we've already done that off camera. <clears throat> we'll have to come back and do this later because this is a new POI and I don't want to do a new POI uh, without doing it first on camera for you guys. Um, so I'll do this off camera. It's just a normal tier one. There's it's not a uh, an investor or anything like that. And then I'm probably going to take tomorrow, in-game day tomorrow off and the rest of today off to get ready for the Horde night. So do basically I'm just going to do a whole bunch of concrete upgrading uh, on our base. And uh, yeah, and get ready for that. And then most likely, unless uh, something changes, uh, when I bring you back in the next episode, it'll be Horde at night 28. And it should be pretty doggone interesting. Um, wait a second. What am I talking about? We have two more days, not one more day. All right, never mind. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. I think what I'm going to do instead is cut the... We're, we're still got to end the episode because we're out of time. Uh, but I think what I'll do is I'll start it right back up and we'll let's just go ahead and do this new uh, POI, uh, this Barbosa residence. Is it Barbosa or Barbarossa? Barbosa. And then um, after that, we'll... We'll, we'll probably go ahead and, and hit this tier three infestation. Okay, so yeah, I, I'm a I'm a day ahead of myself here. Uh, so we still have all day tomorrow, and then day 28 is when I'll go do the upgrades on the horde base. Because I don't have I don't really have to do anything new to it. I just have to upgrade it. So it shouldn't take me you know more than a couple of hours 
to do. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video. We'll start up right where we left off in the next episode after I loot this mailbox. So look at that. Uh, tech Reload rifles 10% faster. I love it. See you guys.